The stage is set and the glittering prize awaits one of these two teams. But which one in the 2022 FIFA World Cup final? Stay with us, we'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Portugal against England. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And the starting role in attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. The England first 11. Jordan Pickford begins in goal. John Stone starts alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. Bukayo Saka plays with Phil Foden out wide. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Harry Kane. And the game begins. Diaz, perfect tackle, oh that's a pass of high quality, Joao Felix, well he couldn't quite hit the target Stuart, well it's a decent effort but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper, keeper playing at well there are many who regard Bruno Fernandes as the complete footballer Stuart what do you think we'll see from him today well he's the most creative player on the field he can run with the ball he can get himself out of tight situations he can see a pass he's very creative with his play I think he's going to be the outstanding player today and the keeper able to hold on to it And he read it well, intercepting it. Ronaldo. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. And he might be through here. Oh, yes! First to score in this final. And it could be highly significant. Well, here it is again. Ronaldo finds exactly the right pass behind the defenders. And Fernandez does the rest. He hits through the back of the ball with such power. What a great finish that is. So, underway again here. 1-0 the score.
Bellingham. And play halted, free kick given. the Brazilians to shut them down good tackle it'll be a throw well not quite what he wanted to do with the pass Bernardo Silva. Well, it really wasn't a great effort, was it? Ronaldo. And a good-looking ball. Well, you can't really head them any better than that. But the goalkeeper was up to the task. Corner it is. And an opportunity for Portugal to make it look even better. Over it comes. Well, it still could be dangerous. Danger averted for now. Well, no surprise there. England have enjoyed most of the possession, but their attacking play has been too slow, mainly due to a lack of movement of the front players. At some point, they have to threaten the space in behind the defenders, otherwise they're going to lose this. Henderson. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. And there it is, the half-time whistle. And that... Well, the ball is moving again, and work to do for England. Can they up the game in this second half? Harry Kane. Henderson. Declan Rice. Failed to keep hold of it. Referee had to be mindful of what was going on, the injury situation, and hence he has stopped play. And so play will be restarted by means of a drop ball. Well, that would be straightforward for any keeper. Sloppy there, Bernardo Silva. England moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Excellent defending. It comes to nothing in the end. And it's a quality pass. Shaw. And taking it away. Joao Felix. Oh, that's a really good run. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. And well, they are committed to making the substitution here.
And there's the delivery. It might still be problematic. Bernardo Silva. And crossed in there. And missing the chance to give them a bit of breathing space. Well, that should have made it more comfortable, shouldn't it? But it's a wasted opportunity. And they will make the change now. Sterling. Now Harry Kane. Declan Rice. And Sterling has it. Sterling! Oh, the equaliser! Just what they needed. And the dream remains very much alive. Well, here it is again. And credit to the goal scorer. But you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. like that and expect to get away with it booking to come you would think and that is going to mean a caution the referee is absolutely right he knew what he was doing there Takes on the shots, and disappointingly, straight into the wall. And that'll be England's throw-in. Sterling. Walker not given a moment to think about it. Sterling. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. Ten minutes left for play. Losing possession a bit easily. On the attack. Is there to be late drama? And I thought that might be the winner. It should have been the winner, but the goalkeeper has done everything right there. That's a vital stop. Who's going to get on the end of it? It comes to absolutely nothing. And Bernardo Silva has it. Now with Ronaldo. He succeeds in clearing it. And that'll be a Portugal throw. Well, just look at this. He's so alive for the situation. That's a neat-headed goal in the end.
they kick off again. 2-1, the current state of affairs. The electronic board has been held in the air, and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Oh, he's really opened them up here. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Well, the keeper had to concentrate. Well, they'll be looking to add to their advantage from this corner. Now sending it in, and still dangerous. Well, it came to nothing in the end. And now it's all over. We've witnessed history. Portugal have won the World Cup for the first time. Well, they've been kings of Europe. Now they're kings of the world. And I have to say, Derek, they fully deserved it. They were great today. Portugal, the world champions! And this is finally Portugal's time. Fully deserved. Best team in the world. Well, you have to give credit to the coach. He's been excellent, but so too the players and these fans. It's absolutely magnificent for them. to be advised giving the ball away there and he might be through here